Hi, this is Jasper. Um, he is my paralyzed dog and he has been paralyzed for seven years and he's 14 years old now. And I just wanted to show you guys because people ask me if it's difficult to take care of him since he's in diapers. And it's really not that hard. Um, it's a little bit time consuming, but it's really easy, especially if you have this little changing station that I have here. I have this sling, I put him in right there and it just helps him stand. And I use two diapers for him. Um, but since he's a male, sometimes the male dogs will pop out of their uh, the single diapers. And sometimes people will use those um, belly bands. Um, I just use a second diaper um, horizontally here. And then I reuse that because it doesn't get dirty usually. <laughs> anyway, so I just, uh, he uses a size three regular uh, baby diaper. He doesn't need the dog diapers because he has a short tail. So he doesn't need the diapers with the holes. And I just uh, use baby wipes and paper towel and powder sometimes if I need, if he's really um, wet, just to make sure he doesn't get any um, rashes from the urine. So to, have, to express his bladder, all I do is um, lightly press on the sides of his belly. You can kind of feel where it's full. It kind of feels like a water balloon sort of and um, just press lightly and if you use um, a baby wipe and just wipe them a little bit uh, sometimes it'll get him to go a little bit more he wasn't changed that long ago so he's not really doesn't have a lot oh there we go okay So what's nice about this stand is I don't have to, I, I mean, I can have both of my hands free to clean him and wipe him. He's also fecal incontinent, so definitely want two hands for that. Uh, so I use paper, uh, baby powder and you can ask your vet about that. Um, obviously I'm not a vet but I'm just showing you how I change his diaper and what I do. So I use the diaper like this and so that the tabs are up on the top. I put the tabs underneath him so that the tabs fasten on top of his back. Make sure it's nice and snug, not tight, but snug and just fasten both sides. And then I use the second diaper that I had earlier just for extra protection right here. And I put it on uh, horizontally over the top of the band of the other diaper. Or you can use the belly bands. I just don't like washing them and all that. Um, super easy. And pretty much that's it. I also use this to change his wraps on his feet um, having both hands free makes it easy to, you know, get it um, on both sides of his feet and wrap it nice and loosely without twisting his, um, his knees and his hocks. And I also will massage him and do his exercises. He was going to a rehab, uh, rehab center for um, paralyzed dogs and they were teaching us how to exercise their legs and it's really important that he feels I mean he doesn't feel the feet touching the ground but the brain knows and senses that it is so it's good for them if, especially if the dogs will most likely be walking again so and he seems to be pretty comfortable he's really used to it and it's really no big deal it's nice to have this up at my uh, waist height so it doesn't stress my back so that's about it and then I just undo the sling and I let him go there you go Jasper good boy thank you say bye Jasper